Merry Christmas, guys. Today, courtesy of Big Bad Toy Store, we are going to take a closer look at this naughty or nice Santa. I've had this on pre-order for just about a year. Today is uh, December 18th, one week before Christmas and my birthday. So go me. I was happy to have this come in the mail uh, today. So here's old jolly old St. Nick in the packaging. As you can see, we've got two head sculpts. There's a present visible. Uh, looks like a naughty or nice. This must be the nice list. And I think there's a couple other uh, little uh, tchotchkes inside, which we'll get it open in a second. Show you the back of the box. What it's showing here is the next line of uh, pre-orders. So if you go to Big Bad Toy Store, you can still order the classic Santa. And they've got Sergeant Santa, the mall Santa. It's new. This new uh, cyborg Santa. <laughs> there's a Krampus. And then there's a pirate Santa down there. Uh, really heavy. I'm surprised at the weight of this thing, but... Looking at the size of the figure, I'm not surprised, but let's uh, get old Chris Kringle out of his uh, plastic prison and take a closer look, shall we? All right, so I've got Santa out of the uh, packaging, got his accessories uh, spread out here in front of me, so let's just show those off first. First things first, you get this little uh, display stand, naughty or nice, with the, he does have peg holes on the bottom of his feet, so that's... Uh, Always cool. Now he comes with the two fisted kind of uh, gripping hands. And you also get two open hands for Santa. Right? And it's nice because, look, they look a little bit like, a, you know, hands that belong on a bigger figure. A little, I want to say fat, but. Um, and you also get the one pointing. So I guess he can put his finger on the side of his nose and up the chimney he goes, <laughs> as it says. Uh, other accessories, and this one's going to be a little bit tougher to show because of the angle, but it comes with a plate and two. They're loose on here. Chocolate chip cookies. Yeah, I just dropped one. But actual, uh, actual sculpted on or painted on chocolate chips. Let me get that in focus. There you go. So that's neat. Um, I would always leave three cookies for Santa in, back in the day that I'm sure my father enjoyed when I was a young uh, lad. The next thing that uh, we're going to show is his list. So it's in a scroll-like fashion, and I guess you can place that in one of his hands. And if you're really good at reading calligraphy, you can make out some names on there. But So he's got his list. Nice. And there's an additional, so on the figure of the package, you've got your basic smiling Santa. And then you've got this one, which is him with a little wink. And also good to mention that the hat does come off and just obviously just sits on both quite easily. So, All right. So while we've got him here, let's take a closer look. Nice job on the on the face. The curled up mustache, the uh, beard, nice texturing on the on the fur. You know the white lining around his collar. It's back of the hat. It's got that uh, John Luke Picard haircut, fire tuck thing going, but with the white hair. Just leave his hat off, I guess, for the sake of moving on down to the belly. Which rolls when he laughs like a bowl full of jelly. Big gold belt buckle. Moving down to the pants. Solid black boots with these uh, cool buckles. Painted in gold very nicely. There's the peg holes on the bottom of his feet. Oops. Sorry, I just... Move the camera all over the place, my apologies. Nice little sculpting on the back and the trim on his sleeves as well as the bottom of his coat. So, you know, for a big guy, now you're not going to get hardly any head movement out of this because of the, the neck. It will twist side to side. And I guess you can get a little tiny bit of tilt out of him. And get the arm up to 90. Okay. Of course you will rotate 
360. I haven't really messed with this. Ben Wise, he got just about 90 out of it. And uh, his wrist does flex up and down, of course, and, and rotate. So that's the same for both arms. There's a slight little cut at the waist here, which I haven't, I don't want to force it too much, but I get a little bit of twist out of him. Um, negligible crunch forward and back, just barely. Uh, Leg-wise, now there's, there's a split on both sides of the coat, which is cool, because that'll allow for the legs to lick up, lift, lick, lift up. And um, let me see, wow, hold on. Santa will do the splits. Okay, there's one. I didn't bend the other knee, but there's the bend in the knee. Of course, you got a up and down, and I think there's a rocker on the, yeah, you do a little ankle rocker on that big boot. So that's, uh, that's your basic articulation. Where's his hat? He just doesn't look right to me without his, without his cap. So this, uh, again, I ordered this last year on, uh, through Big Bad Toy Store. And um, he just shipped <laughs> this this year. I showed you on the back of the box. There's uh, the first wave is what's listed on that box. There's a whole new set of these uh, that's available uh, for release next Christmas. There's a Barbarian Santa, I think a different version of Krampus and uh, several other ones. So if you're interested, uh, get on Big Bad Toy Store. And uh, it's like this first wave. I think there was a... Uh, Minimum quantity they needed of orders to fulfill. Uh, they more than exceeded it. So, of course, this thing shipped out, and I'm grateful. So, I'm going to order the Barbarian Santa, I think, just to have something different on display to go with him. So, there you go. There's your naughty or nice Santa, courtesy of Big Bad Toy Store. Happy to have him in the, in the collection on my birthday, no less, one week before Christmas. Hope you guys are getting out there, get your shopping done. And when you're out there on your own hunts, remember, your grails are out there. Go find them. Merry Christmas. I'll see you next time. Guys, I'm sorry I was in the process of cleaning up and I totally forgot to show the one present. <laughs> so you probably, uh, hopefully you stuck around, but this also came with it. I just, it was off to the side and I just didn't see it until I was putting the camera away. So anyway, final accessory, that's it. There's Santa. My work here is done. I'll see you next time, guys. Later. Don't forget, you can always find Gary's Grails on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, right here on YouTube, or email me at garysgrails at gmail.com. See you next time.